Yo! Today we're going to be doing the sister swap challenge and basically what that involves is swapping styles with the other sister. So as you can see, me and my sister have two different types of looks and vibes. So if you want to see how we both look in each other's outfits, then keep on watching. Oh, I don't want to so do these are all of the products I have. So we're going to start off with my L'Oreal Paris Infallible Mattifying Primer. This is something that I use on a daily basis. So this is basically, I use this a lot during summer and ever since my skin's got back into a better condition, I've been using like tinted moisturisers and stuff like that, oh no. which isn't like a full coverage foundation. Oh, I hate tinted moisturisers. And yeah, like this is really weird to apply with the um, beauty blender. I always do it in my hands. Right, so that's the foundation. So it's like very dewy, very, very sticky. Yeah, it just feels like that. I don't know why. So the next product I'm going in with is my Collection Contouring Precision Pen. And this is like a crayon kind of texture. So I literally just do this oh, on yes. the forehead, like here. Oh, here. It feels like a brick. There. Like One that. thing I'm looking forward to is actually so, having to find cheekbones because I can't contour. Shoot. Eyebrows are like the definition of my face. So what do we do next? I'm going to go with eyebrows on that talk. So we're going to go in with the... <laughs> so this is my Primark PS 3-in-1 brow pencil powder kind of thing. And literally oh, all I do for I this is... I just brush out the eyebrows like that. <laughs> I'm going to look so hippie today. And then I get my powder and I just use the powder to fill in any gaps. So I literally just back comb it into place like that. That's it, that's the eyebrows done. Um, so yeah, not much effort at all. So we're gonna go in with the eyeshadow. So literally, all I'm doing is going in with that like nude, peachy, beige kind of shade there and just using that into the crease to build up color. Ow. Oh. I'm gonna go in with this gold shimmer on here for the crease color, I always just, I don't know, I just fill it in the gaps with this gold colour because it's just nice and sparkly, it just adds a little bit of glam to the look. So yeah, that is the eyeshadow done. I am going to go and clean that up with some concealer. I just made it worse because the back's on my finger. <laughs> oh no, why is it just... It doesn't do that with me. Oh well. No, not oh well. <laughs> yes, Let well. me just quickly like... That is the concealer. So then we are going to go in with what do we do next? So I've got my liquid eyeliner somewhere in here. Um, this one again is another collection product. I use this a lot, I swear by it. So back up. Eyeliner, it's so weird as well. It's not even pointy, it's like a blob. That'll do donkey, that'll do. The product that I'm using on the eyes is the Thick and Frast by Soap and Glory, I think, and it's just this gold mascara here. <laughs> oh, oh, my eyes are getting so irritated. Oh, it's so weird, I've never noticed that before. What? But your eyelashes aren't, like, dark. They're, like, a gingery kind of colour. Ginger? Yeah, not joking, they've got, like, a little bit of gold in them. Oh my god, the white powder. So I've got my Avon Magic X under eye powder, you know, brightener, whatever you want to call it. So literally all I do is I just tip this into the pot like that. Just a small amount. And all I'm going to do here is just put this under the eye like that. And it's still going to bake out any of that fallout. On to powdered contour. This is what I use to set in the cream contour. off with lips and then highlighter obviously so the lip option I have is a Fanta Vaseline lip balm so using my iconic London palette I'm gonna go in with my I just mix them all I just go for it add a bit of color to all angles so I'm just gonna This is just 
just like how I would do my makeup. And that is how I do my makeup. So right, my turn, let's get on with it. So now it's my turn. Let's just take Oh my god, hands. Do you blend it in with your hands? No. Can you explain your product? Oh, this is a Primark 250 <laughs> in the shade porcelain. And I'm using this, I don't care. That is mad. Oh, that's gonna give me diseases. That's gonna give me <laughs> acne again. I've just got rid of my acne. It's gonna give me diseases. There we go. Foundation's done. Beautiful. Easy. For concealer, I use the same foundation but just under the eyes. You use the sort of same concealer under my eyes? I same use the colour. foundation under your eyes, yeah. What, same colour? That's concealer. Yeah. What? Look up. Watch it here. It's scaring me. Hey. Look up. I'm scared, man. I don't have thing in my eyes. <laughs> I really don't. For contour, I use this brush about for about 12 years. Right, so with contour, I'm not really a big fan, so I just kind of swish it all off as much as I can. And then just get a bit of roundness on the face. Done. Done. I do kind of go ODT with the forehead, because I think the brown forehead's really nice. Right, eyebrows is the main step for me. I like my eyebrows. So this is the like colour, so it is pretty. It is dark. It is very dark. So it's not going to suit me. I'm all about the fleeky brow as well. It's got to be like nice and arched and filled in. And that lady. Oh, that's so fleeky. Jeez. A bit dark. HD yeah. brows. If you ain't got them, get them. <laughs> Till bad. Open. Oh, I'm scared of this. I don't want people doing this. Oh. I don't like this. I did not like that. Yeah, that ain't as much so I even do mine, but that is scary. Right, relax. Get to it. Number one's off the weird. Relax, conceal it. Right, go for a nice little goldy whitey colour. I feel like I've got a white face, bright black eyebrows, and like red lips pink too. under my eyes. Oh no, this is scaring me. This is scaring my life. Why? <laughs> is this not good? You don't even wear red lips. I do wear red lips yes. all the time. I, never see you I wear promise red. you now. I I, name one picture of one occasion. Well, with the outfit I wear, I wear red lipstick. If I was going, you're doing this for me because you know I don't like wearing red. I'm not. I don't like it. You so now that our makeup is done, we are now going on to hair. I'm not going to look at the camera because I know I'll probably be able to see myself, especially with red lipstick on. I just know it's going to be like overwhelming. I don't want to see what I look like at all. I'm really scared of the idea. So, um, who's going to go first with hair? Me or you? Yeah, you. You're going to do mine. Not, no, you do mine. You're going to do yours, okay. You're really not going to like this, are you? No, know. I'm not. But I think you might be surprised by the overall. I don't think I will be. <laughs> I think I'm going to faint when I see what I look like. Oh I'll yeah, just I, I just gotta think, you're gonna look as bad as I am. Where's your partner? Middle. What's this? Oh, you've got clips in the back. Oh, have I? Oh yeah, I forgot. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that could have ripped your hair out. I wouldn't mind this hairstyle if it was curled like yours or something, you know? It is curled, that's it. Let me see. Oh, I love it so much! <laughs> I like it, it looks so cute! <laughs> Ew, no, I'm <laughs> <laughs> disgusted. I don't I, even want to look. Right, I'm not gonna look at myself <laughs> today. Now on to clothes then. I, yeah. I don't feel very enthusiastic anymore. I don't. I feel a bit sad. Same. I actually feel you sad. You do look nice though. Like, you like, don't like, understand. I feel like I've been stripped like, away. Like in your eyes, you won't like it, but in my eyes you look nice. I feel like I've been stripped away from like everything I am. So on to the outfits. I am again not going to look at the camera because I'm too scared. So here is your t-shirt. There. So we've got... <laughs> oh no, I hate this And you've this got ready. this there. Oh, I look like a farmer. And then, because I don't ever stick to what I'm wearing anyway, that's the thing. What even is And I've got these blue ears. Would you wear them? Yeah, generally I would. I've picked out like that. And then either those two. So it's up to you whether you wear yellow or the blue ones. So, I've got some black jeans. Okay. And I've got my red basketball top. Okay. With my red coat. This is literally your outfit, isn't it? Yeah, that's actually you. Um, my black and white bag is literally in your room. So yeah, we're gonna get changed now and we'll be back in a couple of seconds, fully transformed. I am not looking forward to seeing like the full result, I'm not gonna lie. Are you? I'm not. Yeah, so yeah, let's go. <laughs> so, 
we have got into our outfits and it's <laughs> safe to say we are both not feeling like our looks no. are we like we feel i feel so out of my comfort zone right now like oh it just feels horrible so yeah should we grab the mirrors and yeah. see what we look like with our makeup and stuff so i've got <laughs> I don't want to turn around. Why? I'm scared. You look I'm like more of the eyeliner. I can't understand it. It's the eyeliner I'm scared more about. Right, ready? Okay. Three, two, one. Oh my god, I look awful. <laughs> what is you my lips? Nice. My lips look awful. And the brows. So you're going to say I look bad. What, what do you reckon you look like? I just look really tanned and like old. And glowy. I look about on 40 on. <laughs> And I've got 12 kids. I hate my hair. Hair is definitely like... No. I hate my lips, I just look like a clown. And like it clashes with my lips, my hair is looking dead. So this is our final outcome. My self esteem was gone like that. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, like... So yeah, this has been Cora and Cassie. Give this video a big thumbs up if you guys enjoyed watching. Seeing us swap our style. Um, compared to what we looked like at the beginning, I would rather be natural and be myself than be like yeah. anyone else and like that's what I've learned from this experience like why change who you are I feel all. like if you're confident you'll look good like I like for you if you're confident in this you look good yeah like like you're not confident so you don't look good but if I wore that I'm really confident so I'll look good so you feel confident in your own vibe yeah. your own style the way you see yourself trying something new I just like my confidence has just gone downhill. Mm, yeah. Like that's just it, isn't it? It's like mm, I couldn't see myself going. But then like seeing this look on you is different. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like you would see me wearing that and think, oh, you look nice. Or yeah, I would say like this looks a bit of a weirdo. Yeah, I think she would it's just nice. a different vibe, isn't it? Yeah. So yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this. It wasn't too negative for you guys. <laughs> I feel like there's a lot of negativity there. We almost turned to tears, but we managed to push through it and here we are it is a learning experience i hope you guys enjoyed watching this type of video and challenge if you have a sister give this trial a go and see how it works and yeah so yeah that's all from us today see y'all later